here riding with Clark County Place 2 Constable Ryan Evans. He is the Beyond the Badge recipient this week, uh, nominated by the people of Clark County. We're out riding today with him. So uh, we're going to take a little ride. Y'all have fun. How you doing today, sir? Oh, pretty good. Wonderful day. Yes, sir. So, uh, Ryan, tell us a little bit about your uh, your background. Why, why did you become a, uh, or want to run for, for Constable in Clark County? Well, uh, I got emancipated when I was about 19. I started riding with some of the deputies and really enjoyed it. Uh, also had an uncle who uh, used to be a constable in the same district. and uh, I just really enjoyed working with law enforcement and had opportunity to, to run and, and was lucky enough to be supported by the people to get it. After riding with uh, the Sheriff's Department for a couple months, I started off as a patrolman with city equipment and worked there for about a year and a half to two years and then started uh, part-time with the Sheriff's Department under Sheriff Kemp and worked mainly nights and weekends with them and, and then had the opportunity to become a constable. My job as constable gives me a lot of flexibility, uh, makes it interesting, never really the same thing every day. I'm in two of the fire departments in the county, equipment and East Equipment Fire Department. A lot of times I'll, I keep my gear with me here in the truck, and so if I'm out and, and fire calls come out, I'll go and assist the fire departments with those. And, uh, also, before I became constable, I was uh, EMT with Paratech Ambulance Service, and so when I'm out, if emergency calls come out for the ambulance, I'll go and, and assist them in those calls as well. What's the uh, biggest misconception uh, that people have as far as constable duties and, and the sheriff's department and the police department? Well, one thing is a lot of people just really don't know what we do. It's kind of all across the state. Um, there's a lot of people just don't know what the job of a constable is. Um, our main job is serving summons and uh, warrants for justice court system uh, but there's there's a lot else to it other than just s serving papers uh, we can answer calls uh, with the sheriff's department or assist the municipalities and uh, we also get out and we can make traffic stops we have rest powers and a lot of people don't know that i've had several people ask me uh, since i went into office uh, what a constable can do and uh, that's, that's for the most part. But it's, it's an interesting job. You get to meet a lot of new people out here, I'm sure, that you don't already know, right? You do, and uh, a lot of the people that, that I come in contact with are good people, uh, kind of going through a bad time. A, a lot of what I serve is uh, summons for back rent, uh, removal from properties, and uh, old bills that uh, a lot of these quick cash loan places, uh, sometimes people get and are un unable to pay them back. And uh, that, that's a big part of, of our papers that we serve. A lot of times we go to wrecks uh, involving uh, children or uh, drunk drivers and you see so many things that could have could have prevented it. And um, it, it's tough sometimes, especially when children are involved. And Rex, that to me, those stick out the most. Uh, right now, we're in a small community of energy up in the northeast part of Clark County. I like to spend a lot of my time patrolling these smaller communities. The, the crime rate is generally very low, and we want to keep it that way. One of the best ways to prevent crime is just being out there and being seen by by the public. And I stamp that on the back of my cars and I'll check the box. Well, there's a lot of people that they know their supervisor district, but they're really unaware of what place they're in. Uh, the judges and the constables are the only two elected officials in the county that go off of a place district. And mine goes from Carmichael all the way north to the Lauderdale County line. I've got uh, almost to the city limits of Enterprise, the majority of Stonewall and, and back down in the parks equipment. So it, it's it's about half the county, uh, what I covered. So it's a pretty large district.
We just made a traffic stop. Um, what did that person do, Mr. Evans? They were swerving across the roadway. Um, they had swerved approximately two to three times, so we went ahead and made a traffic stop on that vehicle. Um, turned out just she just really wasn't paying attention. Um, a lot of times, it, big folks on a cell phone is, is a really big problem today with technology, but maybe she learned her lesson. A lot of people have jobs that they dread going to every day. And I really can't do mine enough. I, I love getting out patrolling, whether it's serving papers or, or, or whatever it is I'm doing. I, I like the people of the county and, and uh, I like the other people that I work with. And it's just an enjoyable job to me to, to get out and not be stuck in an office all day. You're out and, and, and feeling like you're making a difference in your community. Have you ever made anybody mad at you? <laughs> oh, more times than I can count. Uh, I guess that's just part of the job. You can't make everybody happy, but you, you do what you believe is right, and and at the end of the day, that's really all you can do. You, you go by what the law is and, and just try to treat people right. I believe right now I'm probably one of the youngest constables in the state, and to me, I just, I really appreciate the people of Clark County that have, have trusted me to, to serve as their constable and uh, just look forward to doing it for many more years to come. Yep. Yep. Once, it, once it gets in your blood, it never leaves. Uh, you can ask anybody in law enforcement just about it. It's, uh, it's, it takes a special person to be a law enforcement officer. On behalf of Clark County Hot Topics and Beyond the Badge recipient, uh, Ryan, we want to thank you for your time and appreciate the, the ride along today. Yes, sir. Thank you.